Hello, guys. And today we have one more interview. And I'm really glad to see uh, here one member of Attic Club. Attic Club is active blog producers on uh, EOS mainnet. And they are early supporters of Meet One Sidechain. Uh, his name is Vitali. Vitali, welcome to the call. Hi, welcome, guys. Uh, Happy Vitaly. to see everyone. Yeah, thank you, thank you. Uh, Vitali, can you introduce, few, say a few, few words about your BP and why your blog producer is called Attic Lab? Um, yeah, sure. So um, Attic Lab is a software development company and we specialize in the blockchain industry. Um, our team of developers and enthusiasts is located in Kiev, Ukraine. So um, speaking about the name, it's quite simple really. Uh, at the very beginning of our way, um, our servers will be actually kept in the attic and we're also con we're considering the name for the company so somebody I think as a joke suggested Attic Lab and we like the idea and so yeah we you know it's stuck so now we're Attic Lab um, yeah so uh, we've got solid knowledge of computer science, uh, software engineering, um, and finance, and all these things help us to build blockchain-based solutions from scratch, and also, you know, in cooperation with, with um, other members or, or, and blockchain teams. Nice, yeah. nice. So I hope you're right now not on an attic. Uh, no, not really, no. Now I'm at home. <laughs> all right, all right. So the name was on our early stage and you decided to not change. So right now you have uh, offices uh, somewhere in Kiev, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Not in the attic. All right, that's cool, that's cool. Uh, actually, originally I'm also from Ukraine, but uh, we mm -hmm. want the more community see us, so we will we'll negotiate, we'll talk in English, I think it's better. And uh, the next question okay. I would like to ask is about your team. So you mentioned that you are guys in Kiev in Ukraine. So basically, I think your team is Ukrainian people as well. Yeah. So uh, if you can make a brief introduction about your uh, leaders and your team and founders, uh, would be very nice. Okay, sure. So um, our CEO and founder, um, Serhii Vasilchuk, right? So... Um, he is a former software engineer with uh, thorough knowledge of in finance and and you know software engineering. So he's got a wide range of business and technical skills, and that allows him to manage complex software projects that we're dealing with. Right. Um, then we've got Bohdan Oprishko. Um, he is well. He actually majored in physics. Right. But. Um, now he is a project manager and also he is a lead um, UI and UX designer for most of our, you know, most of our projects. That's, that's his work as a, as a designer, right? And we've got um, Vlad as well, Vlad Makaro. So he's a computer science and software engineering uh, major. He started in California. And now at Attic Lab, Vlad is mostly in charge of uh, marketing and sales, right? So, yeah, those are the uh, those are the people. Uh, what about you? Well, um, I am mostly a community manager, um, I suppose. Although I do a little, you know, of everything around. Um, I am, and you know, as a major, I'm a linguist. But then I worked as a technical writer, and here at Attic Lab, I'm a BA and a community manager. So, you know, a little bit of both, I, I suppose. All right, all right. I know. I, I can imagine because I'm kind of that thing. I'm also not a technical person, but uh, try to be connected with the outside world and bring new projects to the Midwine sidechain and also negotiate, talking with the BPs. Uh, pretty nice, and uh, uh, I would like to ask uh, about the infrastructure. You, what you have in like about your servers uh, for producing yeah. blocks? Um, so basically, we're using bare metal um, hardware, right? We're not using um, cloud solutions, and we do that mainly because you know we, it gives us flexibility in terms of tuning our hardware. 
Um, we've got five nodes in different parts of the world. So say Singapore, Ukraine, Germany. Um, so in case of any failover, we can just switch to another node seamlessly and, and continue working. And, and that actually ensures the uptime of 99.96% of the time. Um, yeah. So, um, so oh, well, yeah. So is, is bare metal servers around the world? Uh, so you, how you ma how you manage it? Who is taking care about it in your team? Well, that's that's uh, basically we've got uh, Sergey Rapchan, right? Or as we call him, uh, Phoenix, Phoenix, right? Mm. So he is in charge of of the hardware and uh, things like that. So yeah, basically negotiates all those deals and uh, takes care of of that part of of the whole thing all right all right so you have a person his name is phoenix and uh, nickname uh he's yeah, in yeah he's in our telegram group as well i used to talk to him before yeah he's uh, quite well known uh, persona in um, you know eos uh, ecosystem and and you know meet one and and many others right um i would like to ask about what you guys are doing besides blog production uh, any projects uh, you can introduce sure, the community. Sure. Um, well, block production is just one of the things that we do. Apart from that, we've got, you know, we've developed a cryptocurrency exchange, Codex One, right? So it's been running for quite some time now, you know, quite successfully. What, what, uh, sorry, what, what's the name of the exchange? Codex One, Codex.1. Codex.1. We're going to yes. add all links in, in the description and also. Uh, we'll add it in our article later. Okay, yeah. sure. So I'll, I'll yeah. just, I'll, you know, I'll just send you the links and you know, yeah, yeah, whatever else you need. Sure. Uh, besides that, we developed an uh, open bank IT, which is like an open source banking software initiative. So that was a while back, but you know. Um, and speaking about the latest things that we have, we've built. Uh, MyEOS wallet, which is a you know wallet for the EOS blockchain and BOSS blockchain as well. So it's you know easy to use and uh, safe wallet. Um, and apart from that, we also develop wallets for you know the side chains of EOS. The uh, we have my Telus wallet and yeah my BOSS wallet, like separate ones. Yeah, so those are those are the, the things that we've done so far. All right. Among, so you, among you, others, you, yeah. Uh, as I understand, this wallet also mobile solutions, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's both a mobile wallet and you know, um, desktop wallet. Actually, All not right. desktop, but like you know, the <coughs> sorry. Um, I suppose it's like you know the browser wallet. There you go. Uh, browser. Uh, not, so not, browser. Not 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 the hardware. Yeah. So it's a browser version of the wallet and mobile wallet, uh, which which connected together somehow. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Uh, all right, interesting. We would like to download and know more about this. Uh, I would like uh, what kind of new updates you will have in the future. What kind of news you will have in the future? What's your plan for the next few months or maybe one year? Uh, if you can share some knowledge about it, some some uh, some news about it and deliver it to community it will be very interesting because this video we are recording basically for community uh, to know what kind of web producers we have in meet one side chain uh, so uh, they can vote for you or choose some another BPs is their own decision uh, sure, which sure. want to widely spread information to them yeah so um at Attic Lab, we mainly focus on user experience and, and security and probably stable work of, of the network. So, um, like I said, the user experience is probably of, of the utmost importance to us, which is why we're planning to focus, we're planning to build tools that will uh, make the interaction with the Meet One uh, blockchain uh, from the perspective of the user, simple and, and effective. So all those necessary tools like the, you know, the uh, block explorer, like the wallet, uh, et cetera, et cetera, right? Apart from that, um, you know, we'll dedicate our efforts to um, um, governance and promotion of Meet One, which we think is, is, is quite important.
especially with the, the, the promotion. Yeah. So those are the plans, I guess, for, for the nearest future. And, you know, we have a few other things in mind, but I think for now it's just too, too soon to, to talk about those. You know, let's see how, how things bang out. Right, right. Sometimes you better do, not do act instead of talk and then deliver a product and then the community will see what you've done. Yeah, um, absolutely. I, I agree with you. In, in such cases, it depends on the strategy of the team. Um, the last question I would like to ask from you is like, what kind of message you want to leave for the uh, Asian community and uh, why the users need to vote for Eticlab? Well, it's quite simple, really. Um, our primary goal here is to help meet one grow and reach mass adoption. And we're building, you know, decentralized economy to boost the efficiencies of businesses and, and, you know, people as well. So if anyone shares the same ideas, if anyone has the same ideas in mind, they, they're more than welcome to vote for us and you know, help meet one advance and prosper. Yeah. So thank you. Really nice word. I really appreciate it. Uh, thank you. Thank you for I having me. Ethic Lab uh, was friendly BP from the beginning uh, of uh, launching a mainnet, also on the mainnet, and we was cooperating and meeting each other on our meetup in Shanghai before. And we heard about previous product called Paytomat before, as like merchant uh, wallet mm -hmm. where people can uh, pay by crypto to different different goods. Uh, pretty good idea, really nice and. Uh, we really appreciate the effort of Edic Lab for growing the whole ecosystem, not only Meet One, but also EOS. And wish to see you guys more active in future together with us. Thank you for supporting us and thank you for having, uh, for being on our call today. And wish you a good day. Yeah, thank you for having us. Thank you. And likewise, cheers. Goodbye. Bye bye.